What's going on YouTube family? This is Asnos here coming at you with another City of Final Fantasy Opera Omni video. Tonight we are getting caught up and we are doing the X Death Lufenia. As you can see, I first did it on stream in 48 turns and realistically I don't remember the entire comp that I used. I'd have to go back to my Twitch to see who I used as support. I want to say it was a Furian support, um, which I don't think I have much of any on my friends list. Nope. I do not. Uh, so that makes it, you know what, I'll go ahead and use a cloud and we're just going to work on getting some launches. Launch damage is good damage, right? But first I have to make sure that there is enough off turn HP damage to account for the orb. Because the orb can absolutely get away from us. And it has gotten away from me several times. It's really annoying. Okay. Now the important thing to remember is do not break them when they have the counter break because they will, for one, do a ton of damage to you, possibly kill you, but they'll also remove all your buffs. And the annoyance is that it just they keep flip-flopping back and forth. At one point they will eventually stop doing that for a brief period. And that is a moment where you can kind of open up a can of whoop ass for a wee bit. But it's not perfect. Because they can still get away with you, especially the orb. I've had situations where I'm trying to record this fight and something happens, they get the auger, they delay themselves, and then all of a sudden I have three turns before them and the orb attack is triggered and it's so beautiful. Just kidding. That's such sarcasm. Alright, alright, alright. Now, first threshold is at 80, just under 80%. So once they cross that 80%, is when the orb comes out for both, and then they both get auger. I'm spacing the other thresholds off the top of my head. I want to say it's 50 when they do it again. Okay, now... And, and then we're not going to break A, obviously, because then bad things happen. Nope, oh, there it is. We crossed it. And then, of course, they get a major, major decrease to incoming brave damage. So I will not hit anywhere near as hard. Serve. <laughs> That's bad. But X Death doesn't care about all that. Okay, now. Let's see. I need to put more pressure on A, despite that counter. Then he parts it over to B. And then back and forth they go. Like a good old merry-go-round.
Now, Wool is dangerous in this fight with his high turn rate. He really is. And now... Okay. We're gonna go for A here. Yep, like I said, they flip flop back and forth, they go. Back and forth, back and forth. Now he won't break A. So I can do that. And then, completely take away all that brave. I ain't get shit. Amazing. They didn't flip flop the break. Okay. So I'm going to get a Drain Weapon back up on them, and then I'll swap my Furion for, um... For Cloud briefly, and we're going to take advantage of some launch damage after we get that burst off. Okay. Let's do that LD again. Alright, now... Yeah, and realistically it's... Buckler. Yeah, see, that turn manipulation from Wool is super dangerous. So dangerous. Alright. Neither of them are are going after Virion, so, okay, Cloud will come out, and now we're going to have him burst first. And we'll burst on B. That just jack shit. Funny thing is that <laughs> did the counter, Furion's voice still played out and, and he wasn't even there. Wasn't even there for it. It's hilarious. Okay, now... Yeah, we can, we can go actually... Let's get another debuff out on these fools. There it goes again. They're both gonna do it too. Okay. They both have the break counter. Now we need to refresh the LD buff. Alright, now. Well, we're not going to break them. There's just no way. Which is fine. 
I'm going to rely on X-Death to do that. To bring the Brave down is more like it, but yeah. Okay, now... Let's... Nope, we'll go ahead and Maelstrom now. We have shields, so we're good to go. And then... Oh. Gotta launch off on this fool. With Shining Shield. Alright, and then... Still can't break them, so... Hmm. Alright, now... Now we do skill 2. I'll go ahead and just get him a launch, whatever. He's got too many buffs, or excuse me, debuffs to get taunted, unfortunately. Good thing we have a lot of shields. Nope, yep. Swapping it back. Okay, now, let's see. Ooh, that time, not so much on the mitigation there, huh? Took all that away. And now that count is going to get brought back up. Hey, it looks like they're done swapping, but I do believe they have one more instance of that. Okay, for the sake of just getting out some damage, this is Meteor Rain. Not amazing damage, but hey, it's something, right? And then we got shields. We're golden. And then once my Fearing comes out, we'll burst and then summon right after that. Well, in this case, they're getting all kinds of turns to refresh that orb. So I am in absolutely no danger this time around. Alright, they get their two turns. Okay. Yeah, this, this shouldn't even hit 20 minutes for the video. Alright, here we go. Alright, first things first. Let's go ahead and uh, bring out Mr. Worldwide, get his buffs up. And then we're going to go ahead and do this. Alright, now we'll go ahead and burst it up. Hmm. 
I'll hit A again, and then I'm gonna do the burst on B, I think. Not that there's much of a disparity in the HP, but... Unfortunately, no launches, but that's okay. Ooh, B got pushed back. With 10 turns, okay. Here's how we're gonna play this. I will summon on Furion's next turn, I think. Well, we know the Shiva break does not count. So they can't counter my Esper. Right now... Nice. That was some juicy damage. All right. I want that splash damage out of the LD. I'm not even worried about delaying A. Might as well do as much as I can, right? Looks like it'll be a little bit slower than my, my stream clear, which, hey. That's okay. Because we still had a good run. Now, if I were to break them now, bad things would happen. Like, I would legit die. Too bad, so sad, homie. And realistically, it's partially because I did not get to get the maximum usage out of Cloud in this one. By far. If only. If only that was showing as dead, I would just do this. But I can't. Right, now that I think about it, I should have done skill one because that would have splash damaged some onto A. Alright. Now it doesn't fucking matter. Bye. Well, was not as fast as my stream one. But, you know, again, that was okay. Also because on my stream, I was using a Furion support. I didn't have any of those available, so boosted, all that good stuff. Obviously more damage. Uh, anyway, that being said, we still had a clean run. Hope you guys enjoyed it. It's nasty Asty, signing off.